The six principles of design are repetition, variety, rhythm, balance, emphasis, and economy. Knowing and understanding the principles of design will help you make intelligent decisions to create the effect you want. Repetition creates patterns and sets up a coherent rhythm. It can be done through repeating the same shape, color, texture, stroke, etc. Because repetition happens in the real world, it gives us a comforting sense of familiarity. This image relies heavily on repetition to create visual interest. These are a few examples of repetition present within this single image. Variety makes things more visually interesting. It can be created by varying the scale or size, color, value, texture, etc. of repeating elements within a piece. To create variety within this design, I varied the shape and scale of the stars in the background. Visual rhythm is created through repetition and variety. Rhythm can be slow, fast, consistent, inconsistent, etc. In this piece, a consistent and even rhythm is created by the careful balancing of shapes and elements within the composition. Visual balance can be symmetrical or asymmetrical. An image is symmetrical when the visual balance is distributed equally, creating a mirror image. An image is asymmetrical when visual balance is achieved through counterbalancing. This image is almost perfectly symmetrical, but the few variations added create enough variety to make it interesting and appealing. This image is clearly asymmetrical, as both halves are not mirror images. Instead, balance is achieved by counterbalancing the heavy lower right with the light, empty upper left. Emphasis creates a focal point. Areas that are light in value, brightly colored, or highly detailed draw the viewer's eye more than areas that are dark, dull, or less complex. In this piece, the focal point becomes the title within the center hoop. The text is centered, elevated, it is the lightest value present, and it's the most detailed element within the composition. Economy is created using only what is necessary and eliminating everything that is distracting from the main point. Good examples of economy strive to communicate feelings, actions, or objects in as little detail as possible. Consider these examples. By stripping away all unnecessary detail, we're left with a simple and rather abstract presentation of the original. And even though it's far from natural looking, we recognize it as something that we know from life. In this image, I created the suggestion of a futuristic cityscape by using simple silhouettes and shapes. This creates the illusion of a cityscape in the background without taking the viewer's attention away from the main figure in the foreground. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Visit simpleartips.com for more art tips and tutorials.